certainly have been the primary threat that we've seen here across the Mid-South, mainly in eastern Arkansas. You did have a couple of severe thunderstorm warnings over there, but the good news is those warnings have been allowed to expire. So right now we're just dealing with some heavy rain. You can see this line behind me stretching all the way from Blyville through eastern Arkansas, West Memphis, Marion, even down into north Mississippi near Tunica. And we're even hearing some uh, rumbles of thunder here in midtown Memphis. So we're going to continue tracking this line as it continues pushing eastward, Ron. Well, I'll tell you what, Nick, let's take some time and let's just go through the first alert Doppler 5 radar. I'm going to ask Nick to drive and we'll just take a look at some different parameters and show you some of the things that are occurring around the area. As Nick mentioned, no active warnings right now other than flood warnings, and there are a lot of them all around the Mid-South, even along the Mississippi River. The river is rising rapidly. This additional rainfall not helping it. Now, as we look at our first alert Doppler 5 radar, by the way, there's the aerial flood warning that's in effect for virtually all of eastern Arkansas. But Nick, let's take a closer look at some of this activity that's moving through. Let's start with a look at the Memphis Metro. Zoom in, show you what is moving through right now, and we've got a considerable amount of activity, very heavy rainfall. What about lightning strikes in this area? Because that has really not impacted us here in the city of Memphis thus far, but on this view itself, there are about 17 strikes of lightning.